This movie gives you an introduction to Senec Connect, which allows advanced process and workflow management within SAP PLM7. During this movie, we will explain what Senec Connect is, as well as its add-on components. After this, we will see how Senec Connect complements the SAP business workflow and the engineering record. Continuing on, we will give you a functional overview before we have a look at the user interface. Senate Connect is an SAP PLM7 add-on and therefore runs in the new NetWeaver business client. With Senate Connect, we are targeting two main areas, the management of complex business processes and workflows, and process automation. To support your business process and mirror it in an SAP PLM7 workflow, we provide an array of functions like the following. A workflow design tool which can be used by every authorized user without the need of programming knowledge. That means a workflow can be defined or changed through configuration within hours as compared to weeks of programming. The capability to save your business processes in a workflow template which can be selected and loaded depending on configurable workflow attributes a built-in approval disapproval function, the capability to manually adjust Senate Connect workflows during runtime, or to automatically follow conditional rules by analyzing the workflow metadata, a multi-phase workflow approach which provides you a simple separation of logical workflow segments, a pause and resume function which allows you to stop, for example, one branch of a parallel workflow while the rest of the workflow continues its route. Team definition, which allows the grouping of agents without the involvement of SAP HR. And the dynamic agent assignment, which allows the determination of agents for a task dependent on the objects to be processed. Senate Connect supports the automation of processes by using workflow robots, which are attached to the start or end event of a task. These robots can, for example, check and or change object attributes like the cross plant material status or generate objects like documents as part of a document approval process. The process automation is targeting all the activities a user would think the system should do for them. Automation can be applied to all tasks that can be defined in a repeatable rule. Other Senate Connect functions include task dependent checklists, configurable workflow attributes, the possibility to attach files directly to the workflow without a document info record, the possibility to define delegations and substitutes during absences, process reporting in various output formats, and a summary collector for collaboration with outside parties. This all results in easy visibility of the workflow progress and the embedded information. In the positioning section of our movie, we will describe how Senate Connect relates to the SAP business workflow and the engineering record. We will focus on two variables, process flexibility and process complexity. Our assumption is that the process needs to be executed a reasonable number of times per year. If you have processes of low to medium complexity, we see the engineering record as the system of choice because it allows collecting SAP objects and a simple information flow. If your process is more complex, involves approval steps, team building, and or conditional workflow routes, we see two solution options, SAP Business Workflow or Senate Connect. The SAP Business Workflow provides a development platform and is a good solution if you do not anticipate adjusting your workflow after the initial implementation. Senate Connect works for processes of medium to high complexity because of its advanced configurable workflow functions. The full potential of Senate Connect can be utilized for processes which are changing over time. We see these requirements very often in new product development or in the product change area. We recommend you to consider Senate Connect in this area because it allows you to adjust or completely rearrange workflows without any development or customization. The bottom line, Senate Connect's full potential can be utilized in cases where you have processes of medium to high complexity or where you need medium to high workflow flexibility. 
In the functional overview section of this movie, we will outline the unique capabilities of Senate Connect. As already mentioned, Senate Connect has the ability to load workflow templates into the to be run workflow based on so called control fields. The combination of these control fields determines the correct workflow template for the different workflow phases. Senate Connect allows you to use multiple workflow attributes. In this example, we use the issuing department, which can have multiple values such as electrical engineering or mechanical engineering. The attributes as well as the values are configurable via SAP's standard SPRO functions. One of the cornerstones of our workflow kernel is the conditional route. Based on any metadata value in the workflow, the process can flow through a predefined branch. In this example, we ask the financial assessor to determine the change costs. Based on the entered value, the process will include the manager, the director, or the CFO. The process summary collector was developed in cooperation with SEAL systems. It allows you to do the following. To generate a snapshot of the complete process along with selectable metadata and objects. To send it out to a collaboration partner or simply to place it in an exchange platform like SAP C folders. The pause and resume function allows pausing a specific workflow branch while the rest of the process continues on its way. This function is crucial if you need to avoid holdups and enhance throughput. As mentioned in the introduction, the Senate Connect teams are maintained by authorized business users. We specifically designed this module so that it is not dependent on HR or SAP security personnel. Teams can also be automatically selected by a combination of control fields, such as the issuing department. In this example, we design the workflow only once. Based on whether the issuing department is electrical or mechanical, the appropriate team is loaded into the financial assessor task. With this concept, we can separate the team from the workflow definition, which reduces the overall maintenance. In parallel to the team definition, we allow a more dynamic staffing of certain tasks using the dynamic agent assignment. Here we can determine the correct agent for a task by analyzing, for example, the objects to be processed. In this example, the financial assessor is dependent on the plant where the change occurs. The logic can be maintained in an SAP table structure for different business objects such as the material master, BOM, document, etc. If the task gets activated, the system analyzes the attached objects and finds the right agent for the task. And now, after the theoretical part of the movie, we will have a look into the solution. Senate Connect's personalized workplace shows all my open processes. In this example, I'm involved in different types of workflows or so-called use cases. Budget process, material create process, product change, new product introduction. The lower section displays the tasks I have to perform right now. Along with the task related information, it gives me a graphical indicator if a task is due or overdue. In addition to the personal workplace, Senate Connect can send out an email if a task is assigned to me. The mail contains a direct link to the task and the workflow and can be used to navigate into the application. The Senate Connect Process Workbench gives every user a holistic view about the workflow status, including the current workflow phase and the workflow status, notes, task lists, automation robots, direct navigation to SAP transactions, conditional workflows options, and approval disapproval information. And, also important, it gives a view as to the progress of the workflow at this time. Is it at the beginning, the middle, or the end? In the workflow header, I find all administrative data of the workflow such as process number, process master change number, current master phase, process status, name and detail description, who requested and issued the process along with the coordinator. 
in the next header tab called additional information I can see all the process specific information. This view can be configured to the specific use case. To separate different data areas we are able to define trays for costing, engineering, production and quality containing text, long text, drop down or date fields. As mentioned in the intro the attached files tab can directly manage files without the need of a DIR. Now it is time for me to check out what objects are getting changed or enhanced during this process. The object tab lists all the objects involved in this process. In this example configuration we are allowed to attach documents, materials, bombs and recipes. The operation mode indicates if these objects are just for information purposes or are to be changed. The context menu opens an array of functions including the Senate Connect Selection Advisor which can give me all the relational information of the selected object such as links to other objects, where used and plant specific data such as stock information and price. And this is specifically important if I'm about to change a part which is 1000 times available in stock. That means I need to calculate the scrapping cost into my overall change costs. Another important piece of information I get from the selection advisor is this part already in a competing change process. After I am informed of the process content I can perform my task and close it in the process workbench. This will activate the next task in the flow with the next agents. To send a summary out to a collaboration partner, I just need to go to the Protocol tab, select the right template and either send it out by mail or place it on a communication server. This was just a short overview of a subset of our solution set. We will be delighted to give you a more complete overview in a private demonstration. So let's summarize when Senate Connect could be of interest to you. Are you looking for an out-of-the-box solution based on SAP's strategic PLM platform? Do you need more functions than just an information routing? Do you need to adjust and optimize your processes and you don't want to set up a development process for each change? Do you want to automate non-productive tasks? If you can answer one of these questions with yes, Senate Connect may be the right solution for your company. And so to conclude, I'd like to thank you very much for joining us today. If you'd like to explore further how this technology can be of benefit to your organization, please feel free to contact us in one of two ways. Firstly, by phone on 248-276-8540. And secondly, by email at info at senate-group.com. Thank you very much.